Hey guys, so I decided to do um, March favorites today um, since March is almost over with. So this is not going to be a real long video hopefully, hopefully, so let me just go on and get started. Okay, the first thing, I don't know if y'all can see this, um, it's by Dream Serenity. It's Memory Foam Comfort Topper. It's one and a half inches thick. Um, it does say for a full size bed. Uh, my husband got this for me because I've been having trouble uh, sleeping good. I wake up every morning with my back hurting. It is probably time for us to get a new mattress. Um, but this is amazing. Um, it comes with a five year warranty. Um, it says it has a clean fresh scent so it doesn't really have any kind of a funky odor or anything like that. I know some of these type um, foams do but this one is great and it is um, kind of like Tempur-Pedic. It reminds me of Tempur-Pedic. Um, it is just so comfortable and I believe he got it at Walmart and I don't think it was that expensive either. And you may hear my dog scratching on my door. She wants to come in. Go on Ava. Go lay down. The next thing I'm very excited about, and I don't know if I'm a complete dork um, because I have never owned a pair of these, but I just got some this month, um, so I'm so excited to wear them, but my brand new charcoal gray Converse tennis shoes. I'm so excited. I have never owned a pair of Converse shoes, not in the old days when they were popular, not now since they've became popular, and I was out shopping recently at the mall and decided, you know what, I'm going to get me a pair because I've been wanting some forever. I wanted some in this color particularly, but then I did not realize that Converse came in literally every color you could possibly want, um, and I saw the navy blue ones um, that kind of remind me of denim, and I want those too, so I may end up going back and getting those. But I cannot wait to wear these shoes. I have been wanting some forever. Like I said, I don't know that I'm a complete dork. I may be the only person in America who does not own Converse because I see everybody wearing Converse nowadays. Okay, in my last video in the February favorites, I showed you guys um, wax melts because I've really gotten into those. I've become more obsessed this past month. Um, now, <clears throat> before I show you these, I will say that I just ordered a bunch offline um, of the Scentsy brand because um, I got just a sample of the Scentsy to make sure that I liked it. I wanted to see how different it was compared to just ones you're going to buy at Walmart or Target or the grocery store or somewhere. And um, the one that, the sample that I got was Sticky Cinnamon Buns, I believe. I love it. It's 10 times stronger than the ones you buy at the store. They make my house smell stronger overall. You can walk out of my house from the, like, come out of a bedroom from the other end of the house and smell it all over. It's awesome. So I ordered a bunch of those, so I'll probably end up showing those in my April favorites because um, they're my new favorites, but I just haven't gotten them yet. So until then, I have had a few um, just that I bought from the store that smell good and smell a little bit stronger than um, some scents. For example, this one is Vanilla Bean by Sensationals. I had never heard of this brand. I just wanted to try it to see if they were better than like the Better Homes and Gardens and the Glade ones. And this one smells so much stronger. Even though it says good old fashioned vanilla smell, it actually to me smells like a vanilla cupcake or something. But it smells so good. I mean, it's it, to me, this this brand has been way better than the Better Homes and Gardens and the Glade. And I love that. I love a vanilla smell. And then this is by Glade, but it's a brand new smell it just came out with called Cashmere Woods. And it just gives kind of a clean woodsy smell. Um, if you have like dark hardwood floors in, in your house, it almost seems like your house is supposed to smell like this. It just smells so good. And for, for a Glade smell... This one has really been pretty strong, so I've liked it. And then the third one that I have is by Febreze. I don't know if they just started making wax melts or they have all alone, um, all along, and I just never have noticed. But um, yeah, I saw these by wa um, Febreze, wax melts by Febreze, and it's just the Meadows and Rain, and they are really strong. They're they're going to be stronger than like Glade, um, Glade and Better Homes and Gardens, and they just of course give a very clean smell. And the wax melt squares are bigger. And I don't know if y'all can see that, but, um, yeah, so they, they last longer and they smell stronger. 
So I have been using these a lot this past month, and I do like those. The next thing is um, I just wanted to try some new um, eye makeup remover. This is oil-free eye makeup remover, um, and it's just the Kroger brand, but it says um, it's compared to the ingredients of Neutrogena oil-free eye makeup remover. And I don't necessarily like to buy all name brands. Um, if I can get an off-brand that works just as well for cheaper. And um, it says it removes even waterproof mascara, which is what I usually wear. And it has worked really good. And I like it because it doesn't have any kind of an odor, really. It's not oily and greasy, and it removes my eye makeup within seconds. So this has been some really good stuff. And the next thing I have, this is Burt's Bees Lip Gloss. I love it because it's 100% natural. And have no idea if you can see that or not. The name of this one is called Sunny Day. And it is just a really pretty color. I have it on right now. Don't know how good it's showing up. But I love Burt's Bees. Um, this one kind of has a little bit of an odd odor. It doesn't stink by any means, um, but it doesn't smell good. Um, and of course, once it's on my lips, I don't smell it, but when I like open it up and smell it, it kind of gives an odd odor. Some of the other Burt's Bees I've used don't have that kind of a odor, but I love the color. And so I use this a lot. And the next thing I'm going to show you guys um, I wanted to try some new shampoo and conditioner. I've been using the same shampoo and conditioner for years. I have very, very, very dry skin. Duh. Dry hair. Mommy brain is what I have. Um, I have very, very dry hair. And um, I asked the lady at my salon who does my hair, what is the best thing that you can use just over the counter at any Walmart or Target or anywhere? And she said, if you just want to use something that's inexpensive, use Tresemme um, because it has less alcohol in it, which is going to dry your hair out. So I've been using Tresemme for years and I've liked it okay. Um, but I decided to try something new because I have also heard that after you've used the same one for several months or several years, um, your hair just gets so used to it, it just doesn't do anything special for it anymore. So try something new. So um, I just bought this um, a few days ago, actually. And it's called, um, it's made by Organics. Or it's, they're formerly Organics. Um, it's Ever Straight Brazilian Keratin Therapy. I don't know if you can see that. Um, and it says, an exclusive blend of antioxidant-rich coconut oil along with lush keratin proteins to strengthen and soften the hair while avocado oil and cocoa butter smooth the cuticle for straight, strong tresses, adding a brilliant glow and luminescent shine. Um, I liked it because it said ever straight and I'm always trying to straighten my hair and it has really good stuff in it. Coconut oil, avocado oil, cocoa butter, it smells awesome. You get the mo the strongest thing you smell in it is the cocoa butter. So um, if you don't like cocoa butter, you might not like it, but I love cocoa butter. Um, and I actually got this at Walmart. It was $5.74. I've only used it once in my hair. And um, I have to say my hair is way smoother and softer than it's been in a long time. Um, now, when I washed it for the first time, with the stuff it was actually yesterday um it my hair did not come out quite as shiny as i wanted but like, like i said this is the first time that i've used it and i got the conditioner of it as well um it's only the first time i've used it um and so i'm not a hundred percent decided how much i love it i really like it a lot so far like i said it's made my hair so soft so smooth um, like it had like no tangles in it and it smells so good. Um, but I need, sometimes I, I feel like I need to use uh, shampoo and conditioner several times before I've completely made up my mind how good it's going to be. Like I said, it wasn't quite as shiny as I would like, but normally I put bio silk in my hair while it's wet before I blow dry it. Um, and it helps take some of the frizz out of my hair and I did not use it this first time because I wanted to see how this worked in my hair without anything else. So I'm going to try putting the, um, putting the bio silk in my hair next time I 
wash it and dry it and all that to see if it comes out a little bit shinier. But when I bought this, I also bought the same um, brand of it in flat iron spray. I thought this was really cool. It comes in what's called a flat iron spray and it says to dry your hair completely and then mist the flat iron spray evenly section by section throughout and smooth the hair with the straightening iron. Finish and hold your style by misting all over. And of course it has the exact same smell in it um, which is another reason my hair smells so strong. It just smells so good today. And I noticed that spraying this in my hair really did help me to I'll get it straightened easier and quicker. My hair is very coarse and wavy and it's kind of hard to straighten. Plus I get very lazy. I like I want it straight but it takes so long to straighten it with a flat iron that sometimes I just give up and it's only kind of straight. And this helped me to straighten it so much quicker and easier. So I do like this stuff a lot so far. And like I said it smells amazing. So those are all of my March favorites. Um, not a whole lot this month, but stuff that I have really been enjoying using. And I will do another April favorites next month with my new favorite Scentsy wax melts that I cannot wait to get. Plus, since I told you I was moving in one of my older videos, it's going to come just in time to use the new smells in my new home, which I'm really excited about. So anyway, I will just talk to you guys later. Bye.